Map labeling is something of an art and a science combined. And one of the things we often want to do is just manually move our labels. So in this example, I'll show you how. I've got some labels for populated places in Great Britain. I'm looking at the London area and let's say I decide to move a label. I can do that using the label toolbar and specifically the tool called move a label diagram or call out. If for any reason you don't see your label toolbar, you can get it on screen via the view menu, toolbars, and then label toolbar. So I'll click the move label button. And in this case, let's just move the label for Dagenham. So I'm gonna click it. So when you do this, make sure you've got the layer selected in the layers panel and then click on the label you want to move. So I do that now. You'll get this little pop-up and that always happens. Nothing to worry about. You can just click OK. Now I can click Dagenham and I can move it. And when I'm happy, I'll left click to position it. And I can continue to do this all the way around the map as much as I like. And then the labels will be in new positions. It's a really useful thing to be able to do because you never quite know where your labels are going to end up when you start out. Now, once I've done that, if I decide that I want to undo all that and just go back to the default label positions, I'll double click the layer that I changed the label positions in and I'll go to the label section and then I'll go to placement. And what you'll see is in the data defined section, coordinate X and Y, these little symbols will be yellow. I can click them individually and hit deactivate. Now let me move this window over and you can see, for example, the label for South End and C, I moved that one. So when I hit apply to deactivate the label movement, they'll go back to normal. So move labels in QGIS using the label toolbar and the move a label button.